Hey guys, RC here, back with Football Manager 20, the beta release. This is episode 17, and we are playing as Real Madrid. So, you remember we had had a really good run of form with our new tactic. Well, right after last episode, we played Valencia, and we got drubbed 3-0. Um, we had mostly our starting, but uh, Sergio Ramos had stepped back in. Ferdinand, Ferland Mendy had to come in. Um... Tellas had to move up to the midfield, and, uh, you know, so just still quality, but we got drilled. Uh, Las Palma, we beat 7-0. Uh, <laughs> hat trick for Jovic and Greenwood. Benzema came off, super sub with a goal, and that's going to start a run of goals for him. You'll see him popping up here quite a bit. Uh, we beat Real San Sebastian 4-2. Ramos with a brace. Uh, including a penalty. Benzema with a two-minute brace off the bench. Laganas we beat in the cup fifth round, 2-0. Mendy and Benzema again with a goal. They had a player sent off in the 94th minute. Not a real big deal. Vigo we beat 2-0. Greenwood and Jovic both scored. Both of our strikers on the score sheet. Uh, Madrid we beat 3-0 in the semifinal first leg. Hazard returned from an injury. And promptly got hurt and is out for a while. Greenwood and Danny Olmo. And then we played Villarreal and lost 1-0. Carvajal sent off in the 73rd minute. Um, Yeah, just this one was actually pretty close. And you'll notice every time we move Tellas off the back line up into the midfield uh, with Hazard's injury, lack of depth at that position, um, may you know we're we struggle a little bit, so I'm a little worried about down the stretch. Uh, we are uh, in the knockout first leg. Uh, they want us to reach the semifinal of Champions League. We're in the semifinals, and they want us to reach the finals, semi quarter semi. So I think the finals is next. Uh, so we are on track because we beat Madrid and we actually won the Super Cup, which is not important. We're currently sitting fourth in the table. The loss to Valencia was huge. That opened up a six-point advantage. We were within three. We're just really struggling here. It's really bad that, you know, at least in the Premier League, you can, you know, you can lose a handful of games. Basically, if you don't go unbeaten uh, <laughs> in, in the first division here in Spain, uh, you know, you're getting blown out by Barca or Atletico, and that's what's happening. We've got five losses. Uh, they've only got six between them uh, in the three clubs above us. So, you know, it, it's it's looking pretty rough. So we're going to play Ibar today and then the uh, Champions League uh, knockout round first leg with Liverpool. So let's get to that. Oh, uh, real quick before we jump into that. Um, Amin Guiri, we did put him out on loan. Uh, evidently, I had promised to put him out on loan, and he wanted to do that rather than uh, he was coming off the bench a lot. And with Benzema being in real good form, I went ahead and loaned him out for the rest of the season. So, uh, yeah, so he's he's gone. So uh, I had him on the club. That's a good thing. And also, I think this is going to be the last season because this episode should go up Tuesday, which is the day the official game comes out. And we'll probably have games going up from this season through the end of the week, next week. Um, and I will be waiting on a database to come out. Uh, I did see there's an England 22, 20 or 22 database that comes out every year. Uh, it does take a while, but I'm hopeful that he will release an earlier version, like with the first seven or 11 leagues or something. Uh, he did that a couple of years ago, and I used it. And then there was another guy on that had a, a, a seven or 11 league up on the Steam Workshop. So if one of those two come out, that's what I'm going to be looking for. But what I'm probably going to do is we'll just call, you know, call this done after this season. That'll put us about a week into the new game, uh, the full release. And then I'll just kind of, you know, be looking around and, and, you know, getting things ready for the full save. And, you know, I'll still have my other saves that I've got going on. 
but we'll probably take just a short break because I, I didn't get a break this year. I, I did my FM19 right up and past the uh, release of beta and then rolled right into this. So I didn't get a little break. So I'll probably take a little break right at the release waiting for that database to come out. So just a heads up, uh, I'm not going anywhere, but I will be waiting for that database to come out. Again, that's the direction I'm leaning on my save for FM20, my long-term save. Uh, but again, we may, you know, if you guys come up with some good ideas that I that just get my attention, you know, I could reverse field real quick. But anyway, let's play Ibar today. We are at home. We are favored. They have yet to beat us, which means we're probably going to lose today. Hakimi's out. Carvajal's out. Uh, we don't even have enough players to round out the bench. Uh, Odrazola's coming back in five days, so he can't play. Um, and these guys are unregistered. I don't know if any of these guys can actually play. <laughs> to be fair. Um, oh, you know what? He can. Yeah. All right, we'll put him up on the bench. And... Eden Hazard is injured. Aparicio. Augusto. He's, I think I've seen him. Let's go ahead and pop him on the bench. Just to have players, man. Just in case, right? So he's a mid-center, mid-right and left. That's good. Um, actually, he's pretty good. I mean, he's okay. All right, we're going to go with that. Benzema's off the bench at striker. All right, let's go. Squad number, sure. Augusto. Putting you in the window here, kid, if you play. Do this for the fans. You saw they really care. Always note that because we know footballers don't care about the fans. I was listening to a podcast today for Leeds, and uh, they were talking about uh, it was one of the Leeds announcers Oh, God. <laughs> they're bouncing it off the post. I think they're doing that on purpose. Uh, but the uh, one of the guys that's actually on uh, LUTV right now um, has been there for about 10 years. Well, he came, he said that when he first started about 10 years ago, some of the older players from, you know, the 70s and 80s and, and whatever would actually – that's got to be fixed. The camera adjustment for the goal line um, would, you know, would give him pointers like during the games. Uh, he'd be calling games, you know, from in the box and they'd be sitting right underneath him. And, you know, they would, you know, they would yell up at him stuff that was going on and, you know, things that he needed to because they'd be listening to him, I guess, on the radio or whatever. And uh, he said that really helped him a lot. But he said now it's it's. You know, you really can't get any of the top flight footballers to even talk to you. You know, he said, you know, if, if you, you know, and this was, you know, when they were in, in uh, the first division uh, before the, even the Premier League, right? But now it's uh, Jovic breaks in. Damn it. Um, he said, now, you, you know, if you went up to the Premier League and any of the top level players, they just brush past you and ignore you. So, Golly, come on, fellas. Get creative. All right, we're inspired. 
but we're not doing anything. I always get nervous in games like this where we're just drilling the opponent, it looks like, because we're just letting them hang in it, and... Oh! And, uh, you know, all it's going to take is that one miracle shot or whatever to get FM'd right at the end. Ugh. There's one. All right, Baran off the back line, his second goal of the season. I actually started a personal save with Leeds just to play around with it, and I wanted to try a try to uh, design a tactic around the club. And still in the early going, I, I've liked some of what I see, but I don't see I don't see all the uh, you know the interaction with the players that I really want or expect after from what I, oh, really rough shot by Olmo, put it in with some pace. Keeper could not hold his wrist up and it broke his wrist into the net. Second goal, nice job. So, you know, there's, there's some interaction in the tactic that, you know, that I'm not happy, but I don't see any way to get the game to mirror what I see in real life. So, yeah, it is what it is. Pleased with your performance. Watch your step. Watch your step. All right, Olmo controls it, loses it. Cruz picks it up. No, oh, he was looking to thread the needle there. Luke, oh, I think he put too much pace on that and hit it off the crossbar. Come on, fellas. All right, you're complacent. Tell us, I really need you to be healthy and rested. Let's go ahead and put Vukcevic in. It's telling me to transfer list Vukcevic to get rid of him, but boy, I like him. Oh, no. That was not good. Ooh, dangerous ball back to the keeper. Brought him way out. Horrible clearance. Nice save. One on one. It's hard to score those one on ones. First shot. Demand more. He was off sides. Pretty sure. I'm pretty sure he was off sides. Yep. I think Varon was okay when he got the ball, but Vuksevic was offsides. Yep. Fair enough. And Gareth Bale. Let's go ahead and rest you. Need you need you on the pitch for the next match. I should have played a uh, rotated squad here, but, you know, we've lost a couple of matches that we shouldn't have, and, and we're really... I'm really in a spot where I can't afford any more losses. Come on. Just jerking around with the ball, fellas. 26 to 4. We had we had six and a half times the shots, but only two times the shots on target. 
23 fouls. I think this is going to be one of those games where we may get, you know, there may be a statement that, you know, there was a foul-heavy game kept us from getting into our flow. Um, yeah, we need to be better against better sides. Let's see. Da, da, da. Nope. All right, well, we'll be back for, oh, no. All right, we'll be back for Liverpool in just a second. We're back for the Liverpool match. Uh, we are the home team here in the first leg. Uh, they are the favorites. I'm just going to drop to positive. All right, Bale Davies, Vasquez. Hmm. Davies, huh? Number thirty four. Thirty four. I'm going to go ahead and give them the little faith speech and kick off. <clears throat> Didn't we play Liverpool last season and they beat the shit out of us? I'm thinking. Oh, nice steal by Cruz off of Alexander Arnold. No, 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 no. That's why I don't like crew shooting damn ball. <laughs> Shoot less, damn it. Shoot less. <laughs> Get creative. Come on. We need to we need to get a goal here in the home leg. Although a nil-nil draw would not be the worst thing. I guess. Mo Salah. God damn it. Didn't he score three or four goals against us last year? I'm thinking. I seem to recall him just ripping us a new one last year. Because I think they're the ones that knocked us out of the Champions League last year. Uh, demand more. Ramos is frustrated. All right, Cruz, nice ball. Davies with the run. Give him a target, boys. And that's why you haven't played all season. <laughs> Just saying. Just saying. Yeah. <laughs> so they've got the away goal that's that's brutal all right you know what i'm gonna attacking is where we were at that's what's made the run for us this year all right oh man Gareth Bale is not playing well. Uh, let's bring Danny Olmo to the outside and Buksevich into the middle. Liking that. Militao for Carvajal. Get creative. No, man. They were putting some pressure on us there. Uh, oh, good. Oh, how was that not a foul? He came right through his back. Mane. <sighs> Woo. Right across the face of the goal. Ouch. Come on, boys. 
No, somebody just pounce on this quickly. No, shit. All right, that's good. Tell us. Up to Davies. But you're going to shoot. Damn it. Damn it. Look at the quick touch. Uh, and then Robertson on the break. Our guys get tangled up. Oh, good job. Good little flick away. Greenwood comes back. Oh, get there. Yes. Luka Jovic, his 14th. Greenwood with a brilliant play to get down the field. Not the best shot, but Jovic did not give up on his run to be in position. Awesome, awesome job. Oh, there's a through ball chested down by Greenwood. And Jovich was not there this time. <laughs> no, Firmino. Isn't it Bobby? Bobby Firmino? Oh, good tackle by Davies. Little, little pucker there for the double yellow card. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to bring on super sub, man. Greenwood making some nice plays, but he is just not finishing. Good hustle there. Lost it. Damn it. All right, tell us. Oh, damn it. There's Henderson. Henderson on a run into space. Oh, brilliant ball for Mino. Great save by Coutois. Whew. Could have saved it. That might have saved us. Demand more. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. I would have preferred a a nil nil draw rather than a one one draw. All right, tell us. Through Olmo, crossed. Oh, what a save by Becker! Oh man, he dropped it back to the edge of the six. I thought that was going in. That was not a good attempt at a tackle there, Vucevic. All right, good job clearing it out. Five minutes of stoppage time. Last chance. Last chance. Oh, it's Benzema. No, no. Oh, my God. That looked dangerous for a second. Tell us, Cruz. Oh, God, it bounced off. <laughs> and he's off sides. No, oh, man. How close. How close. Shit. Damn it. Damn it. Oh. No, nah, I'm not going to tell uh you done brilliantly. Yeah, let's let's pump him up a little bit, right? Oh. So close. <laughs> so close. All right, where do we come back? Um Tell you what, I'm going to come back for the semifinal second leg. We're up, well, we're up. Yeah, you know what? No, we're not. Let's come back for Bilbao and Liverpool. I don't know. We're supposed to reach the final, and they are second. And they're going to be favored. 
Yeah, let's come back from Madrid, and then and then we'll do Madrid and Liverpool. So we'll have a couple of matches between the games next episode. But yeah, I think that's what we want to do. So we'll see you guys uh, uh, in the next episode for Madrid and uh, Liverpool. Hit the like button, subscribe, and all that other stuff. And guys, hope to see some comments from you. Let me know what you're thinking, and let me know you're out there be nice to hear something instead of just the echo of my voice we'll see you guys later take care bye oh by the way if you have not seen i put up a real short video like two minutes uh it was the greatest goal in football manager history uh, that i have ever seen it happened against me i put that up a couple of days ago uh so go check that out uh on my uh on my channel have a good one we'll talk to you later bye